last of the heroic Knights Templar, Jacques de Molay was a man of principle, a towering intellect, betrayed by those he trusted. In this episode of Fallen Heroes, experience Jacques de Molay's final tragic hours through the eyes of one of his closest friends and advisors. there? A friend of the temple. Fluarak, the council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. Why you're not rotting in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. We are betrayed. Draw your swords, men. Defend the temple. Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Come with me. Philip's moving faster than we expected. Mm. Another hand is at work here. The Pope? The assassins. Assassins? I thought the Mongol Khans broke their power decades ago. The assassins are far older than Massey, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are virulent as the plague, less easily eradicated.
We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They must not fall into the assassin's hands. Grandmaster, I will.
Pope Clement, hear me? Before this year is out, you will answer for your crimes before God Almighty! And you, King Philip, no punishment is too heinous for the great evil you have inflicted upon the temple! I curse you! Curse you to the 13th generation of your blood! You shall be cursed! Consumed in flames of hunger and wrath, thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close. The Knights Templar, once the proud shepherds of order, peace, and illumination, were no more. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys throw out their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence, uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting. Arno. Can't I go with you, father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. That's forever. Not as long as all that. And when I get back, we'll see the fireworks. And Arno, no exploring, hmm? Yes, father. Too slow. 
Girls, let's hop in it. Just you wait till the guards get here. Quickly, quickly. <laughs> You can't steal one. Thief! Put that back! Ah, uh, hell. What happened? Damn it! The hell's going on? Do you know what the penalty is for stealing? Got you now! Halt! I grow tired of this, citizen. <laughs> when we stole those apples. <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. What should we do now? Shh. Listen. Don't worry. They'll never think to look for us in here. It was my fault. I'm the one who took the apple. Let's see where they're going. Monsieur Franklin, Keep I up. sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judge nations by the character of the Father? We should all be called. Come here, girl. <gasps> now. Father? Fairly at cards, so you stoop to thieving, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man! Oh, step lightly there. You'll hurt yourself. Ah! <laughs> Just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. I've got it, Victor. Sorry. Pardon, madam. Move it! 
Gentlemen, please, we can come to an understanding. Please, excuse him, he's not housebroken. like you probably can't even read or watch. Come over here and say that! Uh, no. Get back here! Over there! Keeping up? Shall I call a break? And where in God's name have you been? Ha! Huh. Got you now, you little shit! Just a little misunderstanding. Nothing to... Your master's arboring a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my home and stole my watch. Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshalsea would be more than willing to sort this out. Sort what out, Olivier? Uh, a most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what, precisely? Wait for me in my library. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. You'll be happy to learn I persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here? Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort, won't she, with you so preoccupied? One of you running amok is quite enough. Remain here and see if Olivier has any chores for you. Sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise.
street yet? Oh, you would love that, wouldn't you? It'd break my heart. Olivier, if I weren't here, who'd do all your work for you? The horses need brushing, boy. Get to it. Certainement, monsieur. Some trouble, mon ami. A letter for Sire de la Serre. It's very important. Oh, calm yourself, Perrault. That letter won't reach Monsieur de la Serre any faster if you drop dead of exhaustion. Give it here. I'll catch you. You must receive it today. It's very... Very important. Yes, I heard you the first time. I'll see that he gets it. Monsieur de la Serre! Stop! Bad luck, lad. You'll have to go make around. Make way, make way! All over. What was that? Damn it, slow down! is a popular finish this season. Who is driving this coach, Pelops? Monsieur de la Serre. Please excuse, on carriage. I need is a bird's eye view.
Back at the line.
Comment a-t-on pu en arriver là Il n'est jamais joué d'ailleurs. Surprenant. C'est dans cette confiance, messieurs, que je vous ai rassemblés et je vois avec sensibilité qu'elle a déjà été justifiée par les dispositions que les deux premiers ordres ont montré à renoncer à leur So, who or what will take its place? Another king? A council of capable men? That is the question, isn't it? A truce, then. What the devil was that about? Oh! Now, now, we can resolve this without recourse to violence, can't we? Get him, Yuko! I suppose not. Big fella. save you now. Let's see what you've got. 
ready for a beating? Not your day, is it, Victor? To your health, gentlemen. You, boy, stop! What are you doing there? Uh, running!
audacieux, très audacieux. Pas mal, je pense. Ah, 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 Bonsoir, Olivier. Has Monsieur de la Serre returned? Senor de la Serre is not expected until late. Ah, well. I suppose I'll just pass the time with Elise, then. Don't get your hopes up just yet. Mademoiselle is at a private soiree, in her honor, at the palace. A party? I wasn't invited. Neither were the horses. <laughs> I'm sure she just misplaced my invitation. I'll find my own way in. Ah, uh, how late is late? Perhaps an hour, perhaps three, perhaps not at all. I do not question the comings and goings of my betters. I'll just wait here, then. Mémoire de Monsieur d'Artagnan, Elise's favorite. I could just slip it under the door. He'd see it the instant he returned. Le traité du monde et de la lumière de Descartes. Never could get through that one. and sound, and only slightly delayed. And now, to the palace. Ugh. I couldn't sneak through a sewer in these threads, much less a ball. Here, here, mon ami. Let me take care of that. Uh, well, thank you, young man. Maximilien Robespierre, no guest. Arno, oh, le chevalier du Telem. Invitation, s'il vous plaît. About that, I had one, of course, but on the way. No invitation, no admittance. Now clear the queue. Next, please. Charles Gabriel Sivet, two guests. Next, please. Two guests. Quite the turnout. Quite.
practically up in arms, and they're having a party. What's this party for, anyway? Not sure. Some kind of confirmation ceremony for the De La Serre girl. Thought you could sneak in. Third estate practically on the ground. They're having a party. What's this party for, anyway? Not sure. Some kind of confirmation ceremony for the Della Serga. Gone. Third estate practically up in arms, and they're having a party. What's this party for, anyway? Not sure. Some kind of confirmation ceremony for the Della Serre girl. Shift change yet? Look at that one. Pretty sure his shoes cost more than my rent. back in if I do. What? Certainly not. Well then, if it's all the same to you, I think I'll stay up here. Come here. I'll see you in the garden later, yes? Of course.
quite the turnout this evening. I can't remember the last time we were all together. It must have been that business with... M'accorderiez-vous cette danse pour gentilhomme? Merci. Un autre jour. She always did love the chase. You seem to have caused quite a commotion. Well, what can I say? You were always a bad influence. Oh, you were a worse one. My father's suit. <laughs> Are you wearing a dress? You don't even start. I feel like a mummy wrapped up in this thing. Must be quite an occasion to get you so fancy. It's not like that. Truth be told, it's a lot of ceremony and pontification. Dull as dirt. Well, when you don't invite me to your parties, everyone suffers. I did try, but my father was adamant. Your father? <laughs> Go. I'll distract them. What? You're kicking me out? It's Complicated. I'll explain later, but for now, out the window. Oh, no, no, no. You're not turning this into a repeat of that apple orchard. Stop being such a baby. I'm sure there aren't any guard dogs this time. <laughs> Go! Ten to one, I end the night cleaning a rich man's vomit off my shoes. I'd like several of these. Six. You all right, monsieur? Too much of the king's champagne. Monsieur. Monsieur de la Serre. Monsieur de la Serre. Sivir, come away. Guards, help. Murder. Bon Dieu. He's killed Lord de la Serre.
wasn't me. Damiel wielded the knife. Please, have mercy. Gallia is omnis divisa in partes tres. They're killing us! Oh, God, have mercy! They're killing the prisoners in here! That's enough of that, you degenerate! <laughs> Where am I? In hell. Welcome to your new home. They're killing everyone! Oh God! Open this door! Scream all you like. No one cares. Where'd you come by this, Pisspot? I'm in no mood for this. Give it back! Take it back. If you think you can. Good. 
much effort for a broken antique. The only broken antique in here is flapping his idiot jaw. Say that again. I've nothing more to say, old man. <laughs> Give me what's mine, and go back to your crazy drawings, old man. Drawings? Bees here. Everywhere. Scribbled like chicken scratches all over this cell. Where? where? Come here, you little piss boy. Get your hands off me. Look at the wall. What are you doing? Concentrate. Concentrate. What are they? Messages from the past. I had myself thrown into half the prisons in Paris in search of these. What's your name, boy? Arno. Arno Victor Dorian. Dorian. <laughs> of course. Pierre Belek. I knew your father. Bully for you. He died at Versailles. Well, 76. 77. December, as I recall, no witnesses. How did you... Your father was an assassin, Arno. He gave his life fighting for the liberty of all mankind. You stick with me, you might just live long enough to join the Brotherhood. Honor your father's memory. <laughs> Listen, I'm sure your little cult is a delightful bunch, but I'm not interested. The only thing I care about is finding Elise. How are you planning on doing that from in here? Again! Ow! Focus, Pisspaw! What the hell is going on out there? Citizens are restless. Keep an ear open, opportunity might just come knocking soon. That was cannon fire. Sometimes opportunity sounds a lot like cannon fire. Secure the prisoners! Follow the lead. This pop before the guards come. Citizen. Prison up against the wall. On whose authority? I told you this was going to end that way. Silence! Stay back! Prison yeah. up against the wall. Stay back! Me for a bit, piss pot. One of them stabs me. I'll haunt you to an early day. Belek, is the door open? Not quite. We have a problem. Find a solution! Lovely. <laughs> 
Selek! Got to be kidding. You've got to be kidding. Got it! Let's go, piss pot! Out the window. Come on! You can't get to it. Pisspot. It's time to jump. What? Prison scrambled your brains, old man. Drink took care of that a long time ago. Now get up here! I can't! That's impossible! Impossible? That's the purview of every assassin boy! You can pluck your head out of your own arse. Come find us. You'd make a great fit. Goodbye, Pisspot! You! Back away from the ledge! That's some welcome. One can't be too careful. But after what happened... Elise, I... Haven't you done enough to repay my father's kindness? Elise, please. You can't believe I killed Monsieur de la Serre. 
Your father, he wasn't the man you thought he was. Neither of our fathers were. I know exactly who my father was, Arno. And I know who yours was. I suppose it was inevitable. You an assassin, me a Templar. You? Does that shock you? My father always meant for me to follow in his footsteps. Now all I can do is avenge him. I swear to you, I had nothing to do with his death. But you did. No. No! By my life, I swear I didn't! Is that...? A letter intended for my father the day he was murdered. Read it. Grandmaster de la Serre, I have learned through my agents that an individual within our order plots against you. I beg you to be on your guard at the initiation tonight. Trust no one, not even those you call friends. May the Father of Understanding guide you, El. I found that on the floor of my father's room. I know, Pin. I didn't know. Neither did my father. How could I have known? Just go. Please. What is this supposed to mean? Yeah. 